Calvin Klein model as a producer over here. <laughs> He's <dude>. so <laughs> fucking hot, dude. Know, what dude. is Burke going is so on, dude? Up. He pegged you. What is going on? He's so brother fucking hot. No way. Yes. Yeah. Dude. His brother walked the cat walk. His brother did walk yeah. the cat walk. Whoa. Yeah. 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 Dude. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. He's here. Did you ever walk a catwalk? Dude, I'm 5'10". You don't want the catwalk. Did you ever walk the catwalk? Did you? Really? If you're under 6, you got to Let me ask you something. Good question. Hey, did you ever walk the catwalk? Have you ever walked your catwalk? Yeah. Have you ever walked the plane? Yeah, dude. Dude, honestly, is your brother hot? Like, hotter than you? He's got a little, put a little weight on, but yeah, no, I mean, same Laurent fucking picture. Saint Laurent picked him. Not yeah, Saint Laurent. Yeah, that's pretty good. Saint Laurent, dude. Saint Laurent. Saint Laurent. Saint Laurent. Yeah. Saint Laurent. Saint Laurent. <laughs> what are they? What are they? Yeah, what are they? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The dickhead is not a big deal. Damn. What do they focus on mostly? Probably his fat Irish lips. No, no. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> dude, because that's all I'm staring at. Dude, yeah, his dude. lips are unbelievable. No, I mean, dude, can I take a lap in them? Isn't that crazy, dude? <laughs> yeah. Most white people have asshole lips yeah. like us. Yeah, it's true. He's are fat fucking oh, dude, just, Latina oh, lips. Oh, man. Hold, what would you do to oh. that? What would you do to that now? Oh, dude, I, I, what would you do to I, that I, now? Te- that is, I would teabag them oh, so good. Jesus oh, really? Christ. Yeah, just steep it in there. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah, dude. Dude. Yeah. So when you see lips like that, your first thing is, I don't, I don't want my penis in there. I, I want, want balls. Ball, only balls. <laughs> yeah. Ball. The penis is for my wife. <laughs> yeah. Dude, it's not gay. Love you only get one. It's not gay. Yeah, yeah. Also, I love this. Because we're going to go Oh, hold on, we're jumping right in. <laughs> Chris has long balls like a horse. Dude, yeah. me too. No, yes. shut up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not yeah. the point. Dude, 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 get this. I got this. is the I, point. My, I penis, got my is penis point. is a grower, but my balls are showers. <laughs> true. Yeah. Dude, yeah. True. I'm always cold up top, but warm yeah. on the bottom. I'm all meat, no potatoes. No, no potatoes right now. It's good to have a big bag. Hold on, slap. I'm yeah. going to... Chris, I'm trying yeah. to be. Does make that I'm noise. To be, it makes that noise. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And ladies love it when their butthole's getting a little, yeah. little, little action. You know, a little tickle, tickle, tickle. Wag. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They'd have to be missionary with their legs behind their head for, their, for my nuts to touch her ass. <laughs> and I'd have to put my finger beneath my nuts to go, there it is. There it is. <laughs> I, yeah, I've been telling Tom, like, your balls sit on your grunt. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's yeah. crazy. If that, I if I sit if I sit too fast too hard, I'm gonna catch a little bit of a ball underneath yeah, the leg. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's a gift, dude. Yeah, that's a gift. My, but I, I do want to get back to the. Yeah, no, I had a point to. Okay, this. yeah, oh, sure. Okay. What was the point? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what, what were we talking no, about? No, yeah, was Eve Saint Laurent. We were talking about his fat lips, Saint Laurent. Yeah. 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 Oh we're no talk- no 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 no. Yeah. We were talking about the mouth party with the nuts. Oh yeah. 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 So like. Yeah. Yeah. So Are you gonna be my plus one? <laughs> <laughs> the Saint Laurent and the Saint Laurent. Who's a Zivi? I just like the idea of going home to your wife and being like, "Baby, you had to see this guy's yeah. lips." I mean, I mean, <laughs> they were undeniable. My penis is still for yeah. you. We're yeah. nuts. Yeah. My dick is We're still We're nuts. Yours. But look at his lips. <laughs> No, so I My understand. Balls are so <laughs> I understand. <laughs> <laughs> they soft because they drank too much. Come on. My nuts are drenched. His lips so moist look like a Saint Bernard got a hole. <laughs> uh, you mean a Saint Bernard? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Point is, you fucking weirdos. I'm very interested in in the the the, the testicle play. Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> test, <laughs> testicle. No, honestly. It's very interesting to me, but I have to like. Do you ever, do you ever pee is, on your balls? I like how academic you're saying. <laughs> no, no, I want to say this. Well, yeah, okay. Me, me I'm yeah, very either, dude. fucking yeah. insecure about it. You guys are playing around. What? You're insecure about ball play? Yeah, because I don't have fucking nuts. They're very yeah. high nuts, so I have to like push them down. <laughs> your nuts so are receding. Girl, you know, if a girl like a dog scratching at the back door, going, "I want to come in." It's raining. Yeah. If if she's around my my nookies, I gotta push them down and be like. No, I, try these. I, I, like, a, like a soft dick fucking porn star, like strangling it from the yes. base to get the blood flow up, to harden it, but it's still hard it, or still soft and not, like, you know, it's embarrassing. Yeah, so no. I got to push my, my nuts down. I'm like, lick them. No, my balls have dynamic. <laughs> my balls Christ. have dynamic range. I'm so sorry. Thanks so much for stopping. By. <laughs> it's so good to be here. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs> no, my balls, my balls, when I'm fucking, go up. 
Yes, everybody's nuts too. They go way up. My nuts were like up before to the, the point where if we move positions too quick and they're on top, I can get smushed. <laughs> My balls can get smushed. Oh. They go up into my like. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. They go way up there. Dude, my nuts come out my fucking ears. <laughs> <laughs> One second, <laughs> fully. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on, babe, yeah. babe. babe. Yeah. I'm getting a call. <laughs> <laughs> she thinks it's a bit. She's like, "You're so funny." You're so funny. Ah. No, seriously, slow down. <laughs> yeah, please stop sitting there. Oh man. Anyway, my dad said that. Uh, uh, <laughs> this is gonna be nuts. He's gonna kill himself. <laughs> be great if it was such a switch. Yeah. My dad told me uh, he hates my mom. Yeah, he and hates. Both gonna hates die tonight. Like, <laughs> but, um, but how are you guys doing? Uh, no, he said that uh, he had chalk all over. We I was playing pool with my dad last week. He came to see a show of mine in, in uh, St. Louis. He drove from Kansas City, and we were playing pool, and he had baby powder all over his hand because yeah. it helps the the yeah, cube yeah, glide. Yeah. And uh, I, he got it all, he was wearing all black and he got it all over his black <laughs> pants and his black shirt. I'm like, dad, yeah. you got baby powder all over you. Like he goes, it's okay. Women like the smell of baby powder. And I was like, <laughs> that what rules. does that mean? He Dude. goes, they love babies. <laughs> <laughs> that is so Dude, great. Dude. It is. It, At your age, knowing your father still like thinks that way, that's a oh, that's a he's, big fucking deal. He's a deal. horn dog, dude. Yeah. Uh, so I told him, I said, so when you get blown, do you have <laughs> the, like it's like you're being changed, your legs go up behind <laughs> yeah, your head. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> every every night before he fucks, he does like the LeBron thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rubs his nuts and yeah, just, yeah, just yeah. jumps up on the bed and is like. <laughs> <laughs> the hooker's like, that's another half hour. Yeah. <laughs> There's a cleaning fee now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I like the fact that he went out in all black knowing no. he was going to hit the powder. Oh, yeah, Damn. for sure. For sure. <laughs> yeah, he knew nuts. what he was doing. Yeah. What, 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 what is your, uh, what's your background? Were you Irish, Polish? Uh, Irish, German, European mutt, yeah, kinda. Yeah, yeah, the British, the yeah, yeah. You know, all that stuff. Yeah, you look yeah, like primarily you're... Irish and German. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Before you say you look like a piece of crap. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm the you same thing. Like I'm Irish, German, and, uh, uh, and Italian. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> I you, you look like you stole it. your nose from my people. Bro. Oh, dude. Uh, <laughs> your beak is unbelievable. You, you yeah. know, the first time I met you was in... Um, Montana. Montana. Yep. Big Sky. Big Sky. Yeah. Yeah. I'll never forget it. I know. Yeah. 2015. So 13. 15. Was it 15? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You I like, wanted won 13. in 13. Yes. And I then, like, when, later. You came, when you came to do it, I was like... This guy won. That's so cool. Oh, I was like, I hate it. life. No, I was in the a swagger hall, was got had to be in full. No, effect. it was the opposite, really? dude. Yeah, because I remember being with um, uh, who's a very funny black comic uh, who should have won. Chris Rock. No, mm -hmm. at Big Sky, lost to Dolce Sloan. Male. Oh, I don't. I that was preacher. My, preacher lost. That him. wasn't my yeah. year. Preacher was a different year than okay. Me. It might have been the year before you. Were yeah, a yeah. Year after. Yeah, yeah. But he was talking to me and he was like, "Man, you won. That must be crazy." And I was like, "I hate this," because <laughs> I was just in fucking. I was in a terrible zone. He's like, yeah. "What?" He's like, "Huh?" He's like, "Yeah." He's like, "You don't respect this." So I was like, "No, I, I respect it. I just I fucking hate it." You want to go to the bar? And he's yeah. like, "I don't drink." And I was like, "Well, I hate this. <laughs> I hate all this." What is am it, I supposed to do? Pretend is he good is drinking in uh, Montana. Montana. Oof. That's what they do. That's yeah. all they do. That's what they major. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that is the major. <laughs> yeah, that's the major. <laughs> yeah. the, uh, call it. Yeah. It's, What's the landscape? You major in like? whiskey, you minor <laughs> in cocaine. Yeah. Math, actually. Oh yeah, it's got to be heavy math. Dude, out it's there. nuts. You know, this has been bothering me. I no one. I've never been offered heroin. I've never been offered crack. Mm. I've this is bothering you. Yeah. Because you think you you give off those vibes of like no I, why I, is no one asking me I know that I give <laughs> am off am I not a fun guy <laughs> yeah, yeah, I yeah. mean what's going on here? yeah there's I'll a little shoot bit. up with somebody in the train <laughs> I mean it's not like I'm you know it's not like <laughs> I'll fall asleep from Trenton to Washington I'm yeah. out there I'm out there in the streets I'm hanging around there do wells I no one wants it is it, I do I have cop energy yes yeah hundred percent yeah. yeah. dude if you put on dude you've cop face cop posture cop energy. <laughs> <laughs> you 
got a cop pally? <laughs> really? You, yes, dude. You are. Holy shit. I'm starting to question everything. We yeah, don't. I thought he was going to pat me down when I walked in. <laughs> <laughs> Just a wand. Yeah, yeah, I'm like, yeah. No, it bums me out because everyone's getting addicted to this stuff. I've never been offered it. Yeah. How am I supposed to get addicted if you're not even giving it to <laughs> no, me every, on an yeah, offer? Yeah, every, every night I got to turn on the news. It's an epidemic. <laughs> you're it's like, like, really? <laughs> is it? <laughs> I, I haven't been offered it once. Yeah. How can it be an epidemic? Yeah, the only I epidemic. swear I'm out there. I'm yeah. looking for Your it. Your only epidemic is not being wanted enough <laughs> <laughs> to get entrenched in drugs and suicide. Yeah. That rules. I know a guy. Oh, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Buying t-shirts. What, is the, what, is, what do you think of, like, what could you get right now if mm. we were to text somebody? Oh, in, like in the your highest phone book. level in your phone book. What's yeah, the yeah. Most? yeah, your access. Right, right, right. Not right, even right. phone book, but like let's like extend it to like because I'm I dating have... myself. Why did I say phone book? No, 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 <laughs> no, no. You're not wrong. You're, not you're wrong. telling get me I pull out book, the Rolodex. Huh? I got just my yeah, Rolodex. Get the yellow pages, kid. <laughs> yeah, but the dangerous people they are they come from like you have to go to like my dogs, like the dudes that like I would call on to be like yo. We gotta. I hate to say this, but like, if there was like a big fight or like I want someone to fuck this dude up and I can't put my hands on him, I'd have to go to Facebook because those people don't. They're not in the realm of like active social media. Yeah. Right. The animals are true street animals. Facebook is everything they have. They don't do Twitter or Instagram. Mm -hmm. Right. Facebook is where all the fucking, you know, the drunk ants go. Oh, and yeah. Fucking, and all the street animals are like, yeah, I always want to know where fucking Donnie was hanging out. Yeah. Like, they know. They know. I, I have three dudes that I could call in a heartbeat to get anything. Literally anything. Anything. But <sighs> I have to travel across state, state lines. I get a gun and I could get a gun in five hours. You think so? I think so. Wow. I think so. I'm talking shit Dude, right now. That's better than Amazon. But I yeah. truly. <laughs> yeah, it is. I have ordered, yeah, yeah, I ordered cologne at a, a, a high volume. It's taken five days and I'm upset. Dude. Yeah. I spent a lot of money on this latest cologne. You got a new cologne? I thought you were on Sauvage. Don't worry about it. You run out of I got Sauvage? A new one. No, I'm, I'm, dude, I'm fucking, What's I'm, the new one? I'm different. Sauvage is Johnny Depp's one where he like, he's um, playing like Jimi Hendrix. Well, once I found that out, I started searching yeah. for other scents. <laughs> yeah, like, I didn't know. Do you like colognes? Let me tell you something. <laughs> a fucking, a maniac cokehead sociopath probably knows how to smell good in, a, in an environment where he shouldn't belong. Mm -hmm. So I, I didn't Sauvage. understand cologne until I was a bar back in a bar. And realized how much people fart. Oh, and wait, it, what? Yeah, <laughs> that, was, that, that was that was not sense. where I thought that, you were going. Nobody, That's, thank yeah. God, there's other people. No, here. dudes are wearing cologne. Hey, dudes more. are wearing cologne to bars to cover up farts. <laughs> That's <laughs> not. Them. True. They are. That's a hundred percent what they're the doing. The guys that you're smelling that are wearing cologne are not farting. Yeah, they care they about are. themselves. Yeah, and they care the about the farters are the fucking like meat fart. wagons that are bopping mm. around because they threw hot dogs. No, it's at camouflage. It's fart camouflage. <laughs> Wait, you Dude. don't put your cologne on like this? <laughs> Dude, it masks it, bro. Yeah. Yeah. No, you, put it, you put it on up here so that when the fart comes what? up, what? it goes to war nah, with the fart. Uh -huh. Here's what you got to do. You got to spend your cologne budget would be in <laughs> And I'll tell you why. You're going to spread you have to spread the the front of your nuts, the back of your nuts and both sides of your nuts. You, <laughs> you're you, it's going to it's going to go quick. It's yeah. very expensive. Yeah, I know. I did perfume. <laughs> 1.7 ounce, 50 de, de bucks. Tola. De tola. De tola. De tola is, that's on cut, right? Mm -hmm. What is that? Yeah. Et de tola. Wait, nope. De tola. De tola. Et de tola. Et de tola. That's eau de pure. Toilet. Yeah, yeah, Burke knows French. <laughs> He's toilet. married to one. Eau de tola. Isn't that, a, that's like uncut <laughs> cologne and perfume, right? Et de tola. And then parfum Parfum. is a lessened version of that. <laughs> And then, dude, guys, wait, do you actually, do you put cologne on? Yeah, yeah we. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. You can't. No one in Kansas, no one from Kansas City is wearing cologne. What are you talking about? Oh, he'd yeah, be a fucking, on, he'd be man. a general in a second, yeah. dude. Yeah. <laughs> You gotta become the mayor of Kansas City. You just sprayed your car noir. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Who's this guy? Dude, this guy has this style. Guy, guy, he's a businessman. <laughs> you want my property? This guy, no, this guy no. smells different, and I like it. Take my no. wife, please. Now, Kansas City is degree 
right? Deodorant? Degree or Old Spice. They Old Spice. But that's not the new old, old spice. spice in Kansas City. That's probably a lot of <laughs> yeah. old spice. Yeah, I don't like old yeah. spice rebranding. No. There's no so fucking. There's no sauvage in Mm-mm. Kansas City. Nah, mm-hmm. there's no cocaine in this <laughs> no, either. There is yeah. cocaine. I missed. It's what? not cocaine. It's drywall. With it, with fucking. It's Red Bull. <laughs> it's Red Bull over drywall, dried up, and that's it. In a cold, <laughs> desolate environment. Red Bull. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, shout out Kansas City. <laughs> shout out. Let's all kill ourselves. Dude. Let's go. Yeah. Do you feel Let's connected, go, dude? dude. Do you I feel like connected this. to your Kansas City roots still, or do you feel like you're all LA now? Uh, I still feel connected, uh, but I've spent so much time in LA now that like you're wearing Sauvage. <laughs> yeah exactly yeah. i've changed a little bit since <laughs> moving to la yeah. uh, there's a problem my with family what? doesn't recognize my scent when i come home and visit i don't smell like alcohol and barbecue anymore yeah. it's a little bit different now. it's they weird it's, it's weird assume. walking through the airport again to see you in a bathrobe <laughs> sex is everything these days too oh yeah. yeah you know man that bomb yeah kansas city airport <laughs> Is there a Kansas City Airport? There, there is. is. Yeah. yeah. What's it no, called? It's interesting. MCI. MCI. Yeah. Sick. You think it'd be called KCI, but no. No, I like that. Yeah. No. Yeah. Make what, it... Yeah. What? What? KCI. It's what? on the Missouri side. Yeah, but what's KCI? <sighs> what, what airport's KCI? Well, KCI, it is. It is MCI. It should be called KCI, like right. Kansas City International, but it's Missouri something international. Uh, yeah. But it, wait, but it's still, there's got to be a KCI being used by an airport. What airport? I don't think so. Really? Mm-hmm. Kentucky Central? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. I think that's KYI. Like KYI. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, it's got to be. <laughs> But Welcome st- back no- to airplane abbreviations <laughs> yeah, yeah. on Stump Island, yeah, Jesus yeah. Christ. where we yeah, really we dive deep. Yeah. Yeah, that's my fault. <laughs> Into flights, flight patterns, flight routes. Yeah. I yeah. made a terrible yeah. joke in 9-11 this whole progress. It was fucking <laughs> it's just brutal. No, but there are some weird... Uh... What if 9-11 was a scent? <laughs> oh, I remember This that. is a good yeah. question. This is a good question. Let's talk about okay, it. Okay, let's yeah. figure it out. Power. Wow. Represents power. No, no, no. Because no. it's obviously smoky. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's ah, like musky kind of. <laughs> no. It's, someone Dude, has to have described not, the scotch like that. Jeremiah, I'm not kidding you. Yeah. Like, this is, I got in a, first of all, the guys that work at, I'm not talking about like fucking low end, lower middle class Macy's. Yeah. You go into Bloomingdale's on fucking 57th. Mm-hmm. These guys. Very cool. Yeah. These guys are fucking artists. Mm-hmm. Right. So I got, I got caught. I had the perfect amount of beers. I was on like beer three or four. Yeah. yeah. I walked into Bloomingdale's. I'm like, I'm going to take a TT because I know all the secret bathrooms mm-hmm. in the city. Yeah. Post quarantine. In the fashion only, district. There's only a few places. No, it's, it's in. <laughs> I know in, all the bathrooms exclusively no, in the fashion honestly, district. Yes, no, I know where to go. Dude. I he does. <laughs> First of all, I really do. I know all. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You know? It's Fifth Avenue by the park. Hi, Tommy. Welcome back. <laughs> go shit in there and then leave. And I'm like, no, I'm looking for cologne. They're like, just go dump. Just you go fucking dump, idiot. you animal. <laughs> <laughs> Let me guess. Taco time with that again, huh? Yeah, you got to come in and buy cologne. <laughs> Dude, and I also have done that where you just walk through like a shitty mall and you're like, you just want to re-up. You know what I mean? Sure. And you walk through like, ooh, what's this? Like, Grab it's not cards, in your fucking, rub them against like, your it's not in your quick. bedroom or your, yeah. Yeah, I've done that, that, that dog shit. Really? Anyway, come up the escalator trying to get to, to the bathroom at Bloomingdale's. <laughs> and I'm greeted by the most, you know, literally a man that the charm was off the charts. Insane. Really? And he took me to like three other people, both of them women. Both. Do you remember three his opening two. line? Um, how are you? <laughs> I don't. But you want me to tell you? How are you? <laughs> well, you want my mind would say? Yeah. How are you looking for a scent today? And he was gorgeous. Oh, and I was yeah. like, actually, in that moment, I was looking for a scent. So I was like, damn, maybe I'm showing him something he knows. You know? Yeah. Maybe I'm going to fucking, I'm going to go to, the, I'm going to try some scents. Mm. And I was like, uh, Creed. I've had Creed before. He's like, let me, <laughs> let me take you higher. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 
That's exactly how the price point went. Yeah, I was yeah. like, how much? A hundred? He's like, hey, you are. <laughs> and it was. What happened was it. I, dude. I, I so yeah, yeah, dude, yeah. They, they do. It's but all based on. How good is it really? Well, man, some blind man see. <laughs> Sway a professional. <laughs> anyway, long story short, the there's That's a pack the of these. Factor was through the roof. There's a pack of these fucking uh, these perfume maniacs, all you know, bopped around me and trying to like force me into buying a uh, cologne. I'm like, I'm gonna buy it. We've been spending like 45 minutes. Yeah, and they're all like telling me about pheromones and like this one might work better for your skin type and this and they're they're all smelling. I got a fucking. I got a, a Korean lady. I got a fucking. Eastern European yeah. woman, and then this guy is like <laughs> deep Smelling in my neck neck, trying to yeah. fuck me. Yeah, <laughs> he's spitting the cologne on me. <laughs> <laughs> Just beat me up, going, "Dare you?" <laughs> so I bought this cologne. I get to the counter. I'm like, I don't care what it is. I'll buy it. Mm -hmm. And he's like, I was like, how much? And he's like, okay, so for 1.7 ounce, it's 275 dollars. And for this, and I was like, wait, 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 wait what? 1.7 ounces. How I much think is with that taxes, I spent like three, 325. Jeez. So I walked in there oh. with the perfect amount of beer and the perfect amount of wallet and the perfect amount oh. of happiness. Yeah. And I walked out and got fucked in the wallet and fucked in the ass. But it's a good but scent. Here's what happened. Before that experience, I was, I was set on never changing my scent i had mm. a scent that this bartender who i was obsessed with when i was 26 years old she told me to go to this burberry scent before that it was all dog shit mm -hmm. and i was like oh shit this girl's trying to elevate me yeah and then i went i went that path for like 15 years yeah the burberry until, path until this gay south american man was like we're gonna change the course of your scent and he did God. and i'm different and I have a new one coming in. <clears throat> what is it? I'm not telling you. Why not? Because I don't want. To, I don't want to say it. Mm. You're worried about the backlash, or you're no, worried about right. other people stealing your scent. There it is. Yeah, <sighs> there it is, dude. And Wait. I said this before. See, that's the have thing you ever thrown decoys at people? Hey, how does this go? What are you doing? Hey, no, I don't do decoys, <laughs> dude. I thought about it. Here, so, like, I'll get I'll get shit on for like things I wear on a podcast. I'm like, yeah, just bring your tiny gay. bottles of Toilette. And music. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I make some. No, that's not me, actually. No, I'll have get, you heard like, of Adidas? <laughs> <laughs> I'll get shit on for like shit I wear. I'm like, but then. That's only like two comments in the in the on the YouTube, mm -hmm. and then I'll get like five, ten private messages going. Yo, where'd you get that shirt? Where'd you get yeah. this? Where'd you get that? So now I'm kind of like, who gets who gets the actual yeah. truth of like what is this? Yeah. Where'd I get that code? Go to Patreon.com. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I put it on Patreon. Why not? There you go. Your patrons. It's a great give them idea. Little tips. Yeah. No, but I give it. I give it all up. But yeah. not the sense. The sense is that's pretty intimate. Yeah, but you did someone. I mean, you, uh, like that this was just so kind of good. bothered me about the bartender. No, the bartender being like, "Buy this scent." It, she wants you to smell like some other dude. Yeah, dude. No, 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 no. She was a stylist. She was. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. I hear you. I understand right? where you're coming from. She no. smelled the guy, and no, she probably smelled me like I was from the fifties. It's yeah. like, why don't you come back into like. You know, you know what's weird now that I look back at it is my mom, when I lived back in Kansas, she would buy the same cologne for my dad, me, and my brother. Yeah. What? So that's a emotional. <laughs> yeah. So, no, that actually. Ew, I dude. know. When I think about it, I'm like, oh, that's kind of weird. Wait, so you were wearing cologne in Kansas? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, was it the one from that, that old Dan, commercial? Dude. What was the old Cologne commercial? Cologne in Kansas is a suicide bomber. <laughs> <laughs> what was the old commercial? Just old ladies falling over. With that guy yeah. go like... Oh, uh, Brew? Was it Brew? Yeah, 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 probably Brew. I think it was Brew. Yeah. Was you, were you wearing Brew? Uh-uh. What were you wearing? Aqua de Gio! That was my fucking oh. high school cologne. Dude, yep. Or college cologne. I wore that in high school. High school was my was yeah. Jakar. Aqua de Gio was because I'm older than you. Aqua de Gio, Aqua de Gio, Aqua de Gio. <laughs> bro, bro. When I when I'm I'm not Kenya, I <laughs> used was, to slay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you right now, frosted glass, yes, and silver yes. cap. Yep, yep, exactly. And exactly. Aqua de Gio was either in black or dark blue. 
Mm -hmm. This is that's fucking, fucking unbelievable. That, so here's how fucking white trash I am. I took Aqua to Geo to a a, a pregame before an Eagles game. I had it in my pocket. I gave it to my brother's best friend. He dropped it. It broke. And I was so worked up, I tried to fight him. And me and my brother didn't talk for like months. Because, because of that, Aqua de Gio. Because of Aqua de Gio. But dude, that was, that's like dropping a fucking kilo of uncut coke yeah. out of a boat. Right. Yeah, this cocksucker drops it in a, in a fucking alley while we're smoking pounders, a bush light. And I was like, I got upset. And he's like, it's fine. It's cologne. But it's not just cologne. Yeah. That's my whole savings. That's my scent. Yeah. <laughs> I've been cutting. <laughs> That's who I am. That's who I am as a person. <laughs> yeah. And I've been cutting lawns. You're stepped all over it. Cutting lawns for fucking months. Oh, yeah. To save dollars Dude, to get my own aqua to Geo. It's very expensive. Yeah. I, I got it for like Christmas. Yeah. It's Did you keep big... it a secret from your friends? Uh, yeah. 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 You don't, because you don't want to freaking, you don't want your other friends like smelling like you all yes, of a sudden. Dude. Well, not it's weird. that. I'm saying, I mean, dude, I want to smell like my brother and my dead. dad for my mom. We want to keep it in the family, dude. <laughs> <laughs> dude. I'm going to hand it down to them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Out of respect. <laughs> dude, you're on your deathbed. It's like, you're like yeah, check Were your Were your will. friends wearing <laughs> yeah. cologne? And for you, Henry. <laughs> um, I think some of my other friends maybe were. But they, we didn't really talk about it, because I feel like that's like that's when like back in high school, like I mean, you know, I'm not asking another guy like. Well, that what was he's... my fear. I remember yeah. like, <laughs> yeah, dude. The but I used to get compliments from girls all the time with my Aqua Di Gio. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Ooh, that's Aqua Di Gio nice. is that's top two, dude. Yeah. Yeah. You know another one? Mm. Ready I'm, for this? A flabbergasted. Mm. Jean Paul Gaultier. It's the one that looked Ooh. like a like a mannequin. It was a man. It was a mass of a man. So it was like the arms cut off and then just went through his bulge and his bird. <laughs> Small balls, mostly meat. And then <laughs> cut off cut off with the fucking knees. Mm. Dark blue with the like gold stripes. Jean-Paul Coutier. Coutier and Aqua de Gio were the newest Jakar. And all three of those scents. Got me HPV. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Beyond belief. That's and, all you need. Dude, do you want to start a kit in the 90s, early 2000s? I don't 90s, know a single 2000s? person in high school that wore cologne. Really? Yeah. No way. Get I mean, out. Was, are we supposed to be like, it's a big high school. crazy. Yeah, that's <laughs> crazy. That no is, way. Well, I mean, I didn't think it was crazy. Now you're wearing cologne. That's insane. Yeah, I can't right. believe that. I can't yeah, imagine you, fucking, you wearing you, cologne. You're you better than yourself. <laughs> You're better than yourself. Listen, I'm trying to get, how do you get, get the smell of garbage. Dude, I, honestly, of, <laughs> of the white you, trashness. I, you how know. do you even do you apply? Try to mask it. Oh, well, do you, do you want to go first? Do how you, you spray apply? And step you know what? Into it? This is a great question. Or do you do a little on the wrist? I wrist actually am not going to shit on this. It's a very good question. And I, <laughs> I will go first. So do you want to go first? Uh, you go first, and I'll show you my technique right after. Okay. <laughs> Number one. Cologne does not go on the clothing. Cologne goes directly on your skin. Cologne has to met. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was a subtle bomb. This truth is bomb, unbelievable. <laughs> it took me years. This guy's what? speaking the truth over here. It took me years to figure this out. Because I would squirt directly on my turtleneck in yeah. 94. Yeah. Before to go on the fucking dance. You know what I mean? Because yeah. I worried about what Jenna would think about my fucking skin's tasting different because I wanted to suck my neck. Yeah. Uh. As you get older, you realize your pheromones. This is why it's important to go to a true the chemi oils chemicologist. <laughs> it mixes with the oils in the skin. 100%. And mm -hmm. helps yeah. Yeah. get it out That's there. why you have to find mm -hmm. your scent. Your scent may be different. You ever yeah. smell just a regular woman, a regular skin of a woman or a man? Yeah, it smells great. <laughs> All right. Well, sometimes it doesn't. So sometimes the scent of that person doesn't smell. It doesn't mesh, right? And you don't know why. <laughs> yeah. You know how some people just smell like waffles? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good smell. That's great. That's yeah. a good smell. That's a great yeah. smell. You mix yeah. it with something else. Could be even better. We're or, talking about, or we're could talking be about way worse. Space waffles, Syrup, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Waffles in space. <laughs> <laughs> That's an immediate bummer, dude. You know, waffles in space? About, do we talk about bath bombs for vaginas? <laughs> Not yet, Chris. Hang in there, Bob. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Are you taking notes? You Chapter want to know? Two. Well, no, if, if, if. <laughs> Dude, that's a second level of Macy's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, no, yeah, yeah. bath bombs. <laughs> and our vaginal bath bombs are right over here. 
<laughs> the worst part about going. <laughs> no, but it makes sense now. And you know, mm. the mixing with the skin oils. Yes, thing. yes, yes. So uh, the application process is number we're one. We're so conservative as it a culture. depends on. This you is got, women be able got to be able to go into Bloomingdale's, get their pussy smelled, <laughs> and have someone hit Jesus them with the Christ. right scent. <laughs> Don't you think? Chris, you asked a question. You want to hear it? You want to hear the answer? Because I've done a lot of fucking research. It's taken so many broken relationships. Think, what? I, I'm I, sorry. I, we just found a rich vein here. I, I know. To, I'm going to fucking start it. A pussy smeller sounds like an occupation at Bloomingdale's. Yeah. And it looks like I would have that job. <laughs> <laughs> you would? Yeah. Right this way, my dad. <laughs> Your nose is like that thing you spray, that little wand you spray cologne on to waft it. Yeah. Mm. Just wafting your I'm nose. I'm getting notes of 1967. <laughs> As if a bit of honey. <laughs> Lots of trash. Backyard raccoon trash. <laughs> so here's what you do. This is the truth. Backyard raccoon trash. <laughs> this is the truth. Yeah. So... You put on skin directly. Yes. Do one to two squirts. You could put on your, your wrist. You're not supposed to smear. So people just like putting on lotion. Lotion. They yeah. fucking rub and smear. It's like, no, you're supposed to gently rub and press into your pores. Mm -hmm. Okay. With cologne, it's a press into. You're yeah. fucking yeah. driving that sex juice directly into your pores, right? Right. Okay. So when it comes to to wafting, people that spray and then drive into it, you're wasting. <laughs> <clears throat> it's a funny adjective. I know. Adverb, well, the price point yeah. is fuck. You're wasting it. Yeah. You're yeah. wasting it. What? If you yeah. want to do anything, spray directly into. If you're gonna <laughs> spray money, it sink into the fibers of the clothes, and it be... does, but it gets lost. It gets lost, and it also <laughs> dyes the clothes. You, go, you you go around one person who smokes a cigarette. It's done yes dude. Uh, if done. i hung up this so if you're sweatshirt by a bar or whatever it's literally done yeah if you're in the bar you fart it's done dude, he keeps you I don't think. fart thing in eventually i'm gonna believe it it's 100 about covering up but farts. do you know my preparation and i can't be convinced otherwise. my preparation for frying chicken or meatballs or meat any 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 style of, of cooking yeah you take the jackets off the hangers there you go the reason for it's going to bleed into the clothing. It's going to affect everything. Yeah, yeah. Mm. You don't fucking spray cologne. First of all, do it right out of the shower. As soon as you're dry, when you're bare, you're giving yourself to Christ or Allah. Yeah. That's when you spray yourself. When you're wet? Inshallah. No, dry. Oh, dry. Okay. Yeah, you wait for the, the beads of sweat to go away. <laughs> yeah. You give, you give a, a, dude, a fucking fresh squirt mm. of Jean-Paul Gaultier. <clears throat> oh, jean -Dolacre. And how do you look at yourself to, in the mirror after you do that? I get on my knees. I do this. Allahu Akbar! Allahu Akbar! Ishlahu Akbar! Really? Yes. And I can't hear that. <laughs> Why can't I hear that? What? Is, yeah. from, from my bedroom? Yeah. Because it's not up to you. You're not ready yet, dude. Mm -hmm. You got a lot to learn. I'm so now, sorry. What kind of prayers do you say when you put your cologne on? <laughs> I just put both. Yeah, I put one hand on both sides of the sink. I look into the mirror. I go, "You got this." <laughs> like that? Not as religious. Going bowling. Yeah. 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 It's a very yeah, yeah. Christian way to deal yeah. with it. It's about fucking passion. Mm. Yeah, cologne choice is a passion. Yeah, it's it's making a decision to embarrass a decision. It's <laughs> making a decision. It's getting this the decision. <laughs> Your cologne is just, just you know, it's, it's a bad way of life. <laughs> All right? The, 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 you don't choose your cologne, the cologne chooses you. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is exactly correct. When I was 13 years old, Aqua George you chose me. <laughs> it popped up out of the yeah. ground. <laughs> yeah, dude. Dude, Jakar Noir threw a stick in my pants and I flipped over the bike. And I was, this is the one for me. You got bit by a radioactive cologne bottle. <laughs> Damn, dude, my, give me your phone. How do you apply? I apply. Thank like you, this i sometimes sometimes i put on if i know i'm out for a while i'll overdo it a little bit at the beginning of the night so it'll last the rest of the night okay but i'll put it on both i go on one left wrist yeah L right wrist neck rub in 
and then pits on the Whoa. close. I like that. Over on the, the close. Over okay. the close. I like that. Over the close as a backup, as a fail safe. I like that. Just in case yeah. I get, I'm working a little bit too hard. Yeah. To be honest, <laughs> yeah. if I really like a woman and I know things are going you uh, her pretty mouth. good, <laughs> <laughs> I choke the fuck out of her. Yeah. yeah. I give her one back elbow. Yeah. <laughs> I drag her you up by her, her feet. With your wrists. <laughs> I take her sneaks <laughs> off first so I can resell them. Mm hmm. No, I fucking, I'll do a, <laughs> belly I'll, do, I'll do a little squirt ski mm -hmm. right here. Yeah. In there. You understand? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. In the, in the pocket, in the what pocket between the tits. Yeah. yeah. You know, hopefully. Yeah. Hopefully like a, yeah, like a mm -hmm. rat chasing fucking raisins. Okay. Rats like raisins? Yeah. Yeah, rats like raisins. Mm -hmm. So they go here, behind the ear, neck. Down the trail, mm. night night, mm. zoo time. <laughs> now now we're feeding the goats. You understand? <laughs> dude, <laughs> now you're putting a quarter, dude. I didn't in know. a machine for some corn, <laughs> and we're feeding goats. I didn't know anything about fainting goats. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys know about fainting goats? Fainting goats? It's hilarious. It's the funniest thing I've ever seen, dude. No, nah. I I never. I saw it today for the first time. There was a UPS driver. What do you mean? You've never seen a fainting goat? Never seen oh my goat. god, dude! And there was a video of a UPS driver trying to drop something off at like a farm, and he accidentally like, hit the fence a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> a whole gaggle of fucking fainting goats just <laughs> yeah dude it's like a dude getting knocked out dude it is the funniest thing in That's the world awesome. what's Fain funnier goats. is goats they scream like men they oh, scream yeah. like adult men yeah, yeah. yeah they go <laughs> dude I was on a fucking kick of watching goats scream <laughs> That's, they sound like a, like a guy in a goat costume just yelling yeah. And there's nothing funnier. Nothing. Dude, I mean, th that has to be the result of some type of, like, inbreeding or something, right? Like, or... Juice? What? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> no. I'm saying the locking up. Oh, the you locking said, up you like said, that? You no, said no, no, let's not just move past that. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Dude. What? <laughs> what do you mean? The Jews? What? You wanted to say something about the Jews. No, I didn't. <laughs> to my goats. Oh, Jesus Christ, dude! Oh man, I heard. I thought you said Jews. Man, Jeremiah. I thought you said really good for you. I thought to you stop said something by. about. It. <laughs> He's like, holy shit, dude! <laughs> was that real? Yeah, I just started laughing. <laughs> dude, that was unbelievable. Well, I, if I if I get it going real hard, wow. I start. Wow, you really did. that yeah. came from your your throat, throat, not your nose. Yeah, yeah that schnozzle is unbelievable, you, I dude. I know, man. Holy fuck! You want to suck it? <laughs> <laughs> Do you use it? Dude. Do you use it down there? I've used it before. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Getting in there. Down yeah. there. He's married. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, I guess you can still. Yeah. Jesus, that's all I meant. But yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's married. He's married. Give, him, give the kid a break. Yeah. He's married. <laughs> he can't possibly be sexually happy. Yeah. Let him go. <laughs> yeah. Is there structure in there? It's all bone. Really? This is Carlos bone. only a tip, all, but this this is if I get hit. I gush blood. It's happened a couple times. Ooh. I freak. I would be the worst UFC. Literally one punch in the nose. I'm like I'm out. It. Water yeah. works. When's the last time you got punched in the face? Uh, the lot. So the last time I got like hit. I, <laughs> the mm, Cologne Wars. <laughs> yeah, Cologne Wars. Two thousand five. <laughs> 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 I was auditioning to be an Abercrombie and Fitch male yeah. model. <laughs> Things Coles. took a turn for the worse. Yeah, Coles and uh, Clifton Heights. Pennsylvania. I've been elbowed way more in the face than anything, like through basketball, and then oh, yeah. uh, and then one time at a uh, a summer camp, uh, I got elbowed. We were doing a bit out on the the baseball field, uh, and um, I I thought the the a friend. Long story short, a friend was acting like he was punching me out and i was like oh uh. and he told me he was only gonna punch a couple times he wound up for another one and he hit the ground and i thought the bit was done and i literally i popped my eyes up and i leaned into his elbow coming straight down into my nose i started gushing blood crying uncontrollably because you know when you get hit like like up here yeah, you just yeah. start like waterworks yeah. but i started going <laughs> it hurt so bad T-shirt covered in blood, 
concussion, had to go to the hospital. That was the last time I got like seriously hit in the nose. Oh. Yeah. And I was loopy. I was literally loopy <laughs> for like eight hours after that concussion because I went to, I took a nap. I'm like, I'm tired. I got to go to sleep. Oh, that's like the number one thing you can't do, right? You yeah. die if you go to sleep. Yeah, no, they literally were having trouble waking me up. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. I felt that like, the, the, I guess they were like shaking me to wake me up. And then like a guy, one of the counselors was doing a sternum rub to, <sighs> yeah. Oh what's gonna i broke my nose once a plan uh we we're playing like the kind of like tag or whatever mm -hmm. but if you got tagged you'd go into like jail which was oh just, yeah, like, yeah in the yeah, house i remember that yeah <clears throat> and to walk you to jail we you put a baseball bat behind your back and i was walking back to my house and i we have like slate stairs in the front and i tripped and oh, you couldn't no. block yourself couldn't put my hands out <laughs> And even worse, because it's like your hands just automatically go forward. So I literally like slammed my head into the stairs. Oh. I remember just everything just mayhem. Here, yeah. Right. And I remember, I remember like pounding on the door. And my friends were inside, like you can't come in here. <laughs> and I remember they like pulled the blind back and saw my face and were just like, ah! uh, just panicked. panicked. Yeah. yeah. Went, got stitches, never got it fixed, still can't breathe through my nose. Really? Yeah. It's terrible. Ooh. Like, I can crack it, like, open. Oh. Yeah. Do you think, if you had to kill one of your parents, would it be your mom or dad? Kill one of them? Yeah. <sighs> Try to switch it up. I don't know. <laughs> hey, man. Hey. If I had to kill one of my parents. Mission accomplished. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> if I had to kill one of my parents. It's been switched. <laughs> Oh man, what a shitty! Yeah, I don't think I could kill my parents. I think I kill myself first. Yeah, really? Yeah, in front of your parent. Ooh, Ooh that's I'm worse. See, that I think is that's worse. worse. Yeah. Do you imagine being in that room where there's like whatever guy's forcing you to make that decision? Ooh. And your parents I bet one of like, your parents is like, "Fuck! Why do you wait so long?" Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah probably. There's got to be one of the parents is like. Jesus Christ, we've been asking yeah. you to do this for years. That would be a bummer if you were like, guys, I'll kill myself. And they're like, yes, yes, yeah, do that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's a great idea. Yeah, yeah. Like, what? No, 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 it was like an option C. Like, I didn't really yeah. want to do it. Or they do uh, one of these like, no, gesture. don't do it. Please. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Actually, put the mm, yeah, thing can upwards. You, this <laughs> yeah, yeah. is on. This I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even mean anything by it. If you uh, had to kill one of your parents, who would you kill? Um... I don't know. That's why I asked you, but uh, I think I kill my, I kill my dad. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Because I know he's he's deeper. He could take it. He could take it, and he probably at this point he's like, I, I, I can't stop by Lowe's anymore and say hi to Frank. Yeah. <laughs> You know. If you killed your dad, your mom would understand. Yes. And yeah. if you killed happier. your mom, your dad would... My mom would love But to. are both of your parents <laughs> still together, though? Yes. Mm, see? My, she would be fine. Mine are divorced, so oh. it adds another layer yeah. to it. There so you go. who do you kill? No, so here's the... Yeah. Mm, probably my dad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah. Do you think it's, a, do you think it's like a, a, a man it, thing? Yeah. I think it's a man thing. And if yeah. it's code. It is yeah. a joke. So you think a woman yeah. would only kill the mother? Or the the woman would kill the father too? I th you, Okay, think of Always animals in the, the wild woman? even. Yeah. To who procreation. Are they, who, who are they going to protect? Are they going to protect the mom or are they going to protect the dad? Yeah. Right. This is Probably why the you're going to kill the dad. This is why the Chinese are all fucked up because they're killing the the girl babies. That's what I heard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. A logical yeah. person would be like, let's get rid of all the men. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah, there's too many dudes chasing happy too holidays. Few happy yeah. holidays. Happy holidays and happy Hanukkah. Hanukkah. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you think. You think. <laughs> It's gonna be a happy Hanukkah. Yeah, sure. it's gonna be eight days of Christmas. I'll tell you that. <laughs> hey, we're doing we're doing eight okay. We're doing okay here. Hey, I like Hanukkah. We're doing it's okay. like eight days of Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> the most American thing to say. <laughs> Do you have anything to plug, Bob? Uh, new stand up on the spots on Is my it? YouTube. Um, Fuck it's an yeah. improvised stand up show. Comedians go up with no prepared material. Ask the audience for suggestions and create stand up on the spot. I got a. 
bunch of episodes up with uh, some of yours and my favorite comics. Just shot one um, at New York Comedy Club on Sunday that'll be coming out. And then Jeremiah Wonders and Scissor Bros, which I got to get you guys on when you come oh, back to yeah, LA. Yeah, yeah, they're, absolutely. Yeah, they're, yeah, absolutely. Stand Up on the Spot is a sick show. I've Dang. seen it in LA a couple times. It's, oh, everyone yeah. seems to love it. It's yeah. super fun. It's super yeah. fun. Yeah. It's just improv. Yeah. Yeah, people like throw it. ideas out and you fucking just try to make a bit out of it. Yeah. It's like it is one of those things that actually helps. I feel like you like actually write shit. Sometimes. Yeah, no, a lot yeah. of people get material out of it. Yeah, so. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So you guys have fun, you say stuff, and then I'm like, which parent would you kill? And then I ruin the entire <laughs> right. flow of the, uh, yeah, yeah. the whole show. <laughs> What's we got an ad we gotta read? Jesus. You pulled it out. I did, but I didn't show you. <laughs> You big ad energy right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't. We don't have to do it. We have to do it. Come right. on, let's do it. Let's do it. Jean-Paul Coudier. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. It's, dude, I, I, I'm i going to read this. You want this. me to read it? Yeah, you do it. All right. <clears throat> we're very bad at this. Uh, Stuff oh, Express. We're very good. Stuff Express VPN. Now, uh, okay. This is, re- he, this is He's crazy. The Express VPN. This is crazy. It is Express oh, VPN, but yeah. why this copy is insane. Remember, he yelled at me last yeah, yeah, episode. Yeah, That's yeah. what it says. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it says. That's what I said. That's a good That's what I said. That's what it says. It's not that easy. You take a look. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'm reading the same thing you read. God, damn it. All right, P. In uh, in 2022, it's shocking every parent has an installed ExpressVPN on their kids' devices. What? <laughs> <laughs> any weirdo could be tracking your kid virtually. What? Who knows what kind of creeps could physically <laughs> physically what? track your kids? That's that's on the copy. Oh, okay, cool. no, it's not. <laughs> Who knows what kind of creeps can physically track your kids down using their IPs? <laughs> <laughs> ExpressVPN hides your real IP address. Just download the app on your phone or computer, tap one button to turn it on, and you're protected. Even an eight-year-old can figure it out. Pick from ni- over 90 countries to reroute your IP address to and watch shows and movies on Netflix from any of them. Like Reservoir Dogs, only available on Netflix Canada. I use ExpressVPN on my iPhone whenever I'm at a hotel or airport because I don't want some creep <laughs> trying to fuck me. I love ExpressVPN because it gives me peace of mind knowing my data is secure. So secure your family's online activity and unlock tons of new shows by visiting expressvpn.com slash stuff island. Use our link and get three extra months free. That's E-X-P-R-E-S-S-V-P-N dot com slash stuff island. ExpressVPN dot com slash stuff island to learn more. All right. That's that's the ad. What People are tracking kids. <laughs> <laughs> People are fucking tracking kids dude. on there. Yeah, should I duck out of frame? Very impressive, dude. <laughs> Very impressive. <laughs> All right, give me my phone back, you, dude, you people, kid fucker. P- yeah. Well, no. Apparently, apparently you can't do that anymore with yeah, Express VPN. Express VPN. You can. There's yeah. a, a slash stop pile. Yeah. Yeah, you can get the... Uh, Stick it to John Wayne Gacy. What's mm-hmm. the sickest but, thing you ever searched? The sickest thing that I've ever searched. Yeah, sorry, dude. Uh, no, no, no I've gotten fun. in. There. I've gotten in there. Like I said, I went. I went through like a phase of like trying to find. You know, there's all those crazy people getting like their heads crushed by stones and shit. You know, those like crazy fucking. Oh, they like they tie a guy to like videos? a tire and light him on fire, stuff like that. Yeah, those fucking dark ass videos. Yeah, yeah. worst video I ever saw that still haunts me to this day was. Uh, you ever have a friend back in the day? They'd just be like, "Hey, look at this." No context whatsoever. No, and no you're like, I can't, you're can't like, imagine. I can't like, imagine that guy. <laughs> Let's be right He's now. that guy. He's yeah. that guy. Uh, there's just a an empty frame with a sh- just a shot of a jar in the middle of the frame, and you're just like, "Okay, there's a jar," and then slowly you see a man's anus squat into frame and start to try to envelope the jar. And then as he's butthole is expanding, it breaks. it breaks. And then there's just blood that starts dripping out of the butthole. And you hear him go, oh, oh no. <laughs> uh, oh, my uh, God. End of video. I'm like, that guy had to have died. Yeah. That's straight to... 
Like, it's, yeah, it's glass that's to your ass. You get <laughs> glass to ass. You don't do that. You don't survive glass to ass. You can't go ass. ass to glass. You gotta go glass to ass. Come on. I mean, it is crazy because that is a whole other like subsect of those like fucking gore videos. Is like dudes electrocuting their dicks or like cut like flaying their dicks and shit. Oh. It's just like what the fuck is that? Yeah. The first, if you're not doing suicide right after that, what's the plan? Mm. Because you can only fillet your dick once. That's not something you can do again. Right, right, right. You know what I mean? 1998. That can do... What? 1998. I swear I got bit by the bug. The what? uh, The gore bug? Yeah. Mm. Watch the video. What was was, was the gateway video? It was a a Russian soldier killing a Chechen rebel. Okay. And he was hogtied. Yes. And he pulled out a Rambo knife. Went through the trachea, outward, and this dude gargled like a pig in his own blood. And we're watching it in in his parents' basement, and I was like, holy shit. Yeah, that's insane. That's insane. Also... (laughs) Also... (laughs) (laughs) Holy fuck. I was ogreish. So ogreish became lively. Lively became chaotic. Ah. So there's like levels to the shit. Oh, they keep like closing the sights down? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I think it is, I think it is strangely healthy to watch a little bit of it. Yeah. Watch a little bit. This is what I say. Dude, I said this on stage. Just to see it, just Mm -hmm. to see it, and then don't watch it ever again. Do you know the funnest part of of those type videos? Or like dudes getting crushed, like, uh, you know, waiting in an intersection and a car being like, you know, out of whack. (laughs) The funnest part? Yeah, like a fucking Mitsubishi Galant just fucking spinning, bopping some bitch like you know, forty yeah, feet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fun. <laughs> Indians love walking on trains, dude. But you're you know not this. supposed to keep watching. And grabbing live wires. Indian dudes love train walking. Grab live wires. I don't think get, they love just it. Just getting I zapped. Think the trains are crowded well, and they have to get up there. Oh, true, <laughs> true, true, true. I've been, I've been I been hope, there. I hope that that becomes like a. <laughs> That becomes like a new stereotype that comics are doing 10 years from now. Like, and these Indians <laughs> keep grabbing the yeah, train wire. Yeah, why are you Come on. <laughs> it's like you never learned. Yeah. What, they don't got a dining car in there? <laughs> Dude. Yeah. Dude. That's how they get from place to place because there's so many people that need to move around. They don't mm. have the Chris, infrastructure. I so they got to sit up there. I understand, Bob. We're having fun. T- <laughs> no, dude, I'm not really trying to get to the bottom of Ew, it. Ew, dude. You got to stop watching those videos. You got to take a break. Less. You got to take a break. It's not good for you. Well, yeah. maybe there's an element of like, you know, of realism and you, you, you understand. There is. The, yeah. But you spend too much time there. Mm. It's like you go on vacation. You have a nice time. You get a little bit of sun. You stay too long, you get burnt. Yeah. You get addicted Oof. to what? Daiquiris? Yeah. Dude, that was, yeah. that was poetry. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy, dude. You've been wearing cologne because you're acting like a real yeah. fucking idiot. Your fragrance. <laughs> <laughs> you're wafting towards yeah. me, dude. It's your sour positivity. cream and onion. <laughs> yeah. By wise. You got, you got, you got some long ball energy. I mean. <laughs> Bottle it up. <laughs> long ball energy. <laughs> No, but you get. You, I think there's a power in in witnessing. And that's know, what I'm saying. I unadulterated seen, violence. W- watching and a death. little bit of it to know how bad it can get yeah. in the world. That it's can maybe, help. Maybe orientate. what I watch, like all. I mean, it's uh, not those videos, but I do like very gory horror films. Yeah. I know it's not real, but like. I watch like all the, the Saw movies and the Hostel movies and stuff yeah. like that. Yeah. I like those. I don't know why I like those. Yeah. Okay. So to this point, I think there's a there's an, uh, an ability due to the availability, right? So there's an ability to, to gain a tolerance to violence. So mm-hmm. let's say you're just a gore person for, for videos or not videos, for a film. Yeah. The same thing can be said for if you're exposed to fighting – and wild aggression mm-hmm. in your upbringing. Yeah. You have a higher tolerance to go, all right, well, there's, <clears throat> I feel something when I watch this fucked up video. And then it continues going, I need more. That doesn't mean you're just going to fucking kill somebody on the street out of nowhere <laughs> no, well, it, with it, a butcher knife. Yeah, and close. Like the people there, because there's like a whole team of people that work at YouTube that have to like 
fucking flag videos and take them down. Like not. Well, they're doing a bad job. No, I'm talking about because I got I got a bunch. I got I'm a saying playlist. Like, <laughs> <brewing. laughs> <laughs> Mister YouTube, you give me a fucking email, yeah. dude. I'll give you a heads up. I'm talking about like the real fucked up shit that people just like post on YouTube. Like, and those people they do literally do tours like soldiers. Like they like. Only can do it for a couple months at a time. Yeah, because oh, it's because so, it's too it's yeah, too much you're on your seeing eyes. The and, yeah, craziest shit. Yeah, because people are uploading stuff all the time, every second. Yeah, every yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Around the world, the darkest, most fucked up, crazy shit. Yeah, and they gotta like find it and fucking take it down fast. Damn. It, so do you those, think those guys in those positions are like they love that shit, right? I yeah, I'm sure there's you know someone I mean? uh, someone who's like I'll do it. Like kind of the guy who works at the morgue is kind of yeah. 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 He's into yeah. yeah. Fucking dead body. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> he cuts them open, open drains them. Hi, Miss Frederick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let me paint your lips. <laughs> I always knew you like rose. Ooh, Try to run. Nice on you. <laughs> Try yeah, to run. dude. If you're in like painting dead bodies, there's something deep there, right? Yeah. Yeah, there's something wrong. You can't yeah. be uh, morgetician. What yeah. do they call them? Mort- mortician? Mortician. Yeah. Did you just call them mortician? Did you think that was fun? I liked it. Mort- well, then mortician. here we are. They added a little I thought that was zhuzh to it that <laughs> I liked. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. A Jean Paul. You know. Yeah. A good to Jean-Ball. kill myself. A little ham? A little ham on it? What? I might end up as a mortician later. Do you see? Now yeah, you get it's it. good. It's there good. you get it. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Look at the moves. Look at the moves. Yeah, I mean, I, I would, I would hope that if someone's gonna drain me when I die in a couple of years, yeah, f- first spray she, me with first some. First, my wife drained me in real life. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> oh, it's so sad how real it is. Do you think you can fuck a dead body? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's a great question. No, well, no, the um, editing tonight. <laughs> no, the, uh, well, <laughs> no. Come on, no is the short answer. <laughs> come on, um, come on. What if you heat it up? Twelve hours. It's hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thirty five yeah, 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 yeah. seconds in the mic, dude. Yeah, yeah. Chef that's, Mike. Wait, that's a. I didn't realize that that's a setting. It's yeah. A, <laughs> it's a preset on there. A dead bot cadaver. What is? It's between dead popcorn crush. and deep. Frost yeah, is, yeah. <laughs> poultry popcorn fuck yeah. like a dead person dead yeah. crush <laughs> reheat that bitch that's your objection is it the heat yeah because I mean <laughs> what if they were still hot that but means you killed it's them it's freezing cold though what it's freezing cold though what do you mean the body's freezing cold no no it's still warm they just died that means you killed them <laughs> no how are you coming across a dead body that's still warm? Let's say you're in a foxhole. Have you heard of the lottery? <laughs> <laughs> heard of it, Tommy? It exists. <laughs> Do you believe in miracles? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, that is a dream. Yeah. You call the police. They're like, we're 30 minutes out. You're like, you're like perfect. Take your I mean, time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 30 minutes, you said. <laughs> mm. I can name that tune in 20 minutes, Bob. <laughs> no, nah, I think you would. What if it was like... Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> I think you Jeremiah, would. I, think, I think you would. Yeah. I think you would. <laughs> what if... <laughs> what if <laughs> <laughs> uh, Anyway, origami's weird, huh? <laughs> oh man, no. I think I think. What if you're in a foxhole? You're with the hottest chick the ever. Hottest also, chick the hottest chick soldier next why to you. Yeah, why would the, the hottest yeah. chick? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And she just got sniped, and there's a you know like a mortar's on its way. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, you can't get out. So your first thought is not to save your body, but to rape her. You can't get out. <laughs> It was not well, the evidence is going to be the evidence is going to be exploding. It's, it's, it's not, not rape if you're dead. It's you're right. It's not consensual. <laughs> but you said the more so, it's, everything's going to be bombed. So everything's going to be blown to smithereens. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no you mean DNA know, and evidence? No one's going to be nothing. Yeah. Blown. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. yeah. Investigators will be none this the wiser. Is, yeah. We're getting canes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? We're getting what's what? that? <laughs> 
<laughs> we ain't canceled. Yeah. Why? This is a hypothetical. This is a BuzzFeed bomb going... <laughs> Come right into our fucking tank, dude. I don't think so. I think we're on pretty solid ground. This yeah. is a classic. Okay. Would classic. You fuck a dead body? Would you fuck a yeah. dead soldier? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? This yeah. is a couple guys Real hanging Patriot out. Real Patriot talk. Yeah. 100%, <laughs> yeah. dude. 100%. Yeah. yeah, it's your last moments on Earth. What are you going to do? So the mortars come in midair. Yeah. And in this, in this hypothetical... How long do you have? Because are you already hard in the foxhole? <laughs> like, see, yeah, you know what I mean? Because like, I think like a lot of it would be just like the rest of your life is just like, come on. Come, yeah, that, yeah, would on. <laughs> that would suck. That would suck. Trying to get it up. Yeah, yeah. I, I need to have sex with this yeah. dead body. Come on. And then you're like, oh, no. <laughs> like, that's your last words. Like, oh, come on. Just get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Yeah. Soft and trying to upset. Like... <laughs> I've also so said this, gnarly. My biggest fear, and then it kind of misses. You just get hit with some shrapnel and yeah, die, and, and then, then you're just like, pants down. Ah, I gotta keep going. <laughs> Dude, my biggest fear is like finding out like what you're into. Do you know what oh, I mean? Like, yeah, yeah. if you're not being no- surprised by um, something, yes. Yeah. If you're not a normal sexual person, and then you have like a very wild, awkward sexual Ooh, moment where you're right. like, your body just reacts a different way. You know? Yeah. Your serotonin is fucking flaring. Yeah. yeah. Your dick is hard as shit, and it's something so weird. But have you had that with anything else in life? No. That's the biggest fear. That's what I'm <laughs> saying. Our, our house is haunted. But what if you don't know? Yeah, why, why does the door keep open? Yeah, I don't know. I think I, Shane's coming in and out. But anyway, so you're worried about like getting caught. I'm worried about weird... recognizing something about my body that I didn't realize was a thing. But have you had that with anything? Like, have you had that with like another experience? Is there like a type of music or <laughs> have you ever like? No, I mean weird shit. Not a fucking, not a Dave Matthews yeah, there's band. weird music out there. Yeah, dude, we're talking. I'm, I'm saying like. I'm saying something weird just happens in your life and you go, oh, no, I like that. Oh, Mm. You know, mm. yeah. Like if a girl like, oh man, you might like killing, like ogreish stuff. If you had to kill, you might really enjoy killing. I feel like you could, but like, I don't get sexual with that shit. It is, I just it's get psycho- stimulated. It's, it's well, it's 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 still. I guess it's a level of stimulant that mm. you'd have to question. I think that's more for my my therapist. You know, yeah. going like, why do you feel this way? Why are why are you so elevated mm. watching this stuff? Why yeah. can you go to bed? watching this stuff i have a theory on that because at six years old my brothers made me watch platoon yeah oh. and that was my comfort and it was in my parents bedroom so i was ingratiated with extreme violence oliver stone's first epic war movie and the purest depiction of war and you've been chasing that dragon ever since i don't know yeah i wonder I wonder. I'm trying to think the last time I was really like blown away by something and went, oh my God, I like this. It might have been NASCAR. <laughs> <laughs> was it when fucking, what's his face? The no, I mustachio walked, I, I buried went to himself a NASCAR, in the wall? I went to a NASCAR event being like, I'm not a huge car guy. I don't really care about this sport. Oh, and I walked I in okay, and yeah. I heard the roar of those engines and I was like, oh mama, this is dope. Yeah. yeah, it's cool. I get it. I had like a visceral like. Yeah. I like this kind of feeling. Yeah. Well, that's fun though. That's just loud machinery. I know, but You're not I talking did, about I death. guess what, that's what I'm saying. I, well, I'm sorry. I was, you know, I'm trying to come. Don't find be something. sorry. It's the same thing. I hear. When's you. the last time you had like a visceral reaction to something like that that you just have never, hmm. you never thought you'd like it, and you went, "Whoa, that's that's for me." I don't know. This is also one of my biggest fears. Yeah. That Sorry, nothing... Jeremiah, do you have something? Uh, mine's kind of boring, I think. The last time I had like a visceral reaction to something, uh, it was a food. What's it called? Um, poke bowls. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what the frick is this, dude? Oh, my. They are oh. so good. It was unbelievable. I was like. You caught the fish this morning? <laughs> this is unbelievable. I went to Hawaii and I had a poke bowl in Hawaii. I've had them like in the past. And I was like, eh, I don't really get what the, all the hype is. And I was like, is this what everybody's been talking about? Yeah. It, it blew my mind. Yeah. Fresh poke bowl. I yeah. wish it was poke bowls. Yeah. <laughs> I love how I'm like, 
I mean, I watched a movie of Asians getting their limbs blown off. You're like, have you tried their food? <laughs> <laughs> a very exceptional you appreciate cuisine. what they were yeah. fighting for yeah, yeah. <laughs> i guess it depends on but what that is the other scary thing that nothing get, nothing gets you going like that you know yeah yeah new frontiers yeah are there any that's the point like also i had a conversation you know? with, with shane about this earlier it was like you know his path and and his success right now is like uh we're starting to experience things that are so grandiose and so fun that it almost deadens the nerve of like what is contentment and fun. Sure. And having like an elevated like sense of like, holy shit, not just awareness, but like happiness. And then if you do it so much at a higher level, as opposed to going, let's say, you know, growing up, I only went to like one Phillies game yes. or one Eagles game. Exactly and about. now you're absorbing all this shit. And now... You start to get all these things going on. It's like, well, what what is happiness for me? Yeah. Do I need to turn it up? Do I need to like, yeah. Do I need to shift what you know? Like, you get addicted to it, right? Because yeah. it's like, yeah. Of course, it's it's well, literally it's a drug. Yeah, yeah. Because you do a bunch of cool shit for like three or four weeks in a row, and then you have like a week of just like normal life again, and you're like, ah, am I failing? You no, know, like for fucking sure. Fucking up bad. For sure. Yeah, yeah. Because otherwise, I'd be at an Eagles game. <laughs> yeah, right, like, yeah. right. If things were going well, good, I wish I'd, I'd be didn't. like in front of a thousand people right now. Yeah. Yeah, I think that I've known people who, you know, they'll do, they'll book a TV show or a movie or something like that. And then they get used to the catering on set and that being like a normal thing where their breakfast is being delivered to them. And then they get super depressed as soon as they go back home and do a normal life because. All of a sudden, their expectations are way higher than what reality actually is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But at the same time, you go back home and you realize that was it. That's out there. That was it. Right. Simplistic lifestyle. Yeah. So this is like what I'm thinking about. It's like, all right, well, all that cool shit elsewhere. The best part about those those experiences is if you're with your boys. Yeah. yeah if you're not with your boys you're like oh this is just fucking you're putting there's you nothing know, to yeah yeah you're, you're, you're not just, experiencing you're a, strip, you're a strip joint getting a dance by some like that's what that is to me yeah but like if you minimize it and you could go home and go to like your local bar it's like this is the life yeah yeah that's true it's like yeah. and it's on every level this is what they say about like fucking people that are like really make it you know, like fucking millionaires and whatever the fuck. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen to eighth grade There's people me. out there with listen, guys with a hundred thousands of dollars. Yeah. There's yeah. some thousandaires out there. <laughs> you know what I mean? They yeah, get yeah, so yeah. they get so rent for them, not even an issue. They're so distant <laughs> from reality and what like they what makes them happy. They they're chasing something that's not fucking real. Yeah, yeah. If you're alone during that, then but yeah. that's in every industry. I'm not saying this because we're doing what we're doing. It's like. That's every fucking aspect of mm -hmm. your life, no matter what you do. It's like, are you chasing? My father said this to me. My dad re retired, but he couldn't retire. I don't know if it was because he couldn't handle my mother at home. And he goes, I, I got to get a job. Yeah, I got I got to keep active, right? Yeah, and then course. he got a job at Lowe's. Uh, and he's trying to get fired at Lowe's because he knows everything. He's old school. And the new school guys, he goes, Tom, the fucking, these guys don't know anything. <laughs> They're terrible. Yeah, These kids are pussies. And they know nothing about anything and they just fucking get by and they're getting paid. I don't like that. So they keep they keep my dad as a manager and he goes, I don't want to get promoted. They're trying to promote me. Uh, and every my mother comes in to, into the room. He goes, Tom, did dad tell you about his report card? <laughs> and I was like, what's that? So anytime I go, I go home, my mother loves trashing my father. Because it's the only time she can get over on him because she knows I'm going to bust his tits in front of her. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, report card. My, my dad's like, Gene, will you fucking stop? <laughs> and she goes, tell him what you got, Steve. Tell him what you got. And he's like, it, it, it's, not, it's not that. And she goes, an eye. Needs improvement. My <laughs> father's getting a report card at 74 years old oh, at fucking Lowe's. Dude. Because... He's so good at his job. The only thing they could say to him is like, you need to prove So you got to stop cursing at people. So <laughs> my dad's going around going, don't be a fucking dickhead and go help her out. And they're like, Steve, we appreciate everything you're doing. Like, you got to stop cursing at the staff. 
<laughs> These guys were. Really, hey, bitch tits. Yeah. We need you in the locker room now. <laughs> what? Yeah. 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 Maybe you'd get there sooner. You wouldn't have to ask me if you weren't so fucking fat. Right. Like, he's fucking, he's wild, dude. He's old school. But you know what? I bet most of the customers go there for the cussing. That's what I'm saying. For that damn cussing. And that's a dying breed. Yeah. And they keep trying to promote me. He's like, Tom, I'm trying to get fired. I've had enough. I can't keep doing this. He's like, I'm so good at my job. What does he What does he get if he gets fired? Does he get something? Yeah. No, he's good. The point is he's good. He just yeah. has the mentality of working. He wants. He doesn't want to stay home. Yeah, he wants to work. He's fine. He's got a pension. He's got a. He's got all, all the things from the union. He's good. He it doesn't need to work. Yeah, to, to I mean, step. your dad yeah. just lived a life of highs and lows. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> True. True. Hey, get back. Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, blowing your Dude. brains out in the lumber section. That's Crap. that's how you finish that's, it. That's, that's, that's how you finish it. Come on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Get out of here. Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> goes right into the what wood. <laughs> Multiple fingers. Huh? Huh? Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, should we switch to the page? Yeah. All right, what are we at? One away. Oh, One more. What? One, One away. <laughs> sign, sign up for the Patreon. Yeah. I've never done this before, but sign up for the Patreon. Yeah, sign up for the Patreon. Yeah, sign up oh, for the Patreon. Uh, the Patreon. Yeah. Literally, we've never ever said to people on free episodes. This well, is episode 54. We thought it wasn't cool to do. It's not cool. Yeah. But at this point, I don't give a fuck. Promotion, self promotion. Yeah. It's scary. I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> I don't know. No. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> don't do it. If don't you do must. It. Oh, yeah. no. Just, hey, don't, even don't, throw the yeah, don't, don't, don't do it. it. <laughs> All right, All right, switch the page. Dickheads. Let's go.